everyone and welcome to this special episode of police simulator patrol officers this is episode number 300 i can't believe we've made it this far it is totally amazing thank you to all you guys for your support for the channel and for the series because without you we wouldn't be here and as you can see i've managed to get myself a partner for this special occasion we're going to be out and about with uh, geezer gaming his link will be in the description below hello geezer how's it going thank you for being here today really do appreciate you sparing some time always always a pleasure man i'm really really happy to be here especially on such a special episode number 300 it's uh you know phenomenal what you've done and like I said uh, before, looking forward to uh, what the future holds for you. Lots more episodes, I'm hoping. <laughs> oh, yeah, I really, really do appreciate that. And I think today we're going to go for an hour long episode. Hopefully we'll start down here on the highway. If we end up getting pulled into the city, then that is not a problem. In, um, yeah, there we are. Alrighty. And we are going to be taking the tactical outfit because that is going to be released on the 13th of August in update 14.4. So, uh, yeah, you can get your hands on that on Tuesday. Um, we're going to be going with no glasses for this one. And, oh my life, there's so many options now to choose from. Yeah, it's definitely definitely an exciting time for all the people who are looking forward to the, to some new skins. Oh yeah, definitely. Alrighty, look at us all decked out in our undercover outfit. It's gonna be so fun. Just wait for Mr. Geezer there to get his um outfit chosen. And we are Come on. Oh going the wrong way. Just getting rid of this. Yes. There. Oh, there we go. Right. Come on. There so we much go. to choose from now. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah. Look at that. Looking absolutely fantastic. No, no tactical vest for me, but we're good. And we are going to be using a special livery that was made by Kitty Raw. I'll wait for you to change your Alrighty. your livery there. And just like to give a thank you to Kitty Raw and Rico for going ahead and making that livery. I really do appreciate it. It's a splendid livery. And we'll just go ahead and pop it on. Roll through all these new liveries as well. Oh, look at that amazing livery that is right so make sure we've got everything in our trunk which we do excellent all right all aboard 119 <laughs> you can show me 1041 tonight Oh, I just heard that. Oh, 119 negative. I'm going to be 10-6. Unbelievable, right? Oh, look at that. That's a big one. Yep, literally just made outside the precinct and we already have an accident to deal with. Hmm. I can tell this is going to be an interesting episode. You got that right. We got so many things to respond to two seconds in. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 
Okay, we have, looks like, three vehicles involved. Okie dokie. Good evening, sir. Trooper mine, Franklin High Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Yeah, that makes two of us. I don't understand either. Um, do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance at a vehicle? Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Okay, Kai Harrison, that's going to be valid, and that is also going to be a valid zero Mike Juliet Fox Trot 74. Alrighty, sir. What have we got here? That is going to be all good. Perfect. Have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs I should be made aware of, sir? Alrighty, so just bear with me, and I'll be back with you in a moment. Just get the uh, the photos of the scene for you. I oh, appreciate that. Good evening, sir. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Do you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle. Excellent. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Okay, Cayetano Silva, that is going to be valid, and that is also going to be valid. Seven, Zula Yankee Hotel, 2-1. And that is going to be clear and valid. Perfect, sir. Have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Alrighty, sir. Just bear with me and I'll be back with you in a moment, okay? Evening, sir. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Okay, what have we got? Here, Dylan Baba, that is going to be valid. And he does not have any insurance. Okay, sir, at this time you're going to be getting a citation for no valid insurance. And have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of, sir? Alrighty, sir. Here is an accident report for you, and you are going to be free to leave. However, as you do not have any valid insurance, I'm going to be impounding your vehicle. Uh, so you are free to take out of it any personal possessions that you would like to take with you, and then I'll be taking the keys off you, okay? And once you've gone ahead and got all that uh, documentation sorted out for the vehicle and got some insurance, you can go down to the nearest impound yard, pay off any fees, and then you can get your vehicle back. Okay, sir? So you will be free to leave, but it will be on foot. You have a wonderful evening. Now we've just got to check what vehicle is his, and that is going to be a Ford or something, and it's going to be this taxi cab here. Yes, it is. Perfect. 119, can I get a 1051 down to my current 20 for a impounded vehicle? Time for dispatch. Okay, sir, thank you for your patience and cooperation. Here is an accident report for you. And you are going to be free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. You take care. Alrighty, sir, here's an accident report for you. You are most welcome, and you are also going to be free to leave. You have a wonderful evening, and you take care. One nineteen. Can I get a ten fifty one down to my current twenty for an immobilized vehicle?
turn four dispatch. And 119, can I get another 1051 down to the same 20 for a immobilized vehicle? Turn four dispatch, uh, 119, by accident scene is going to be code four, and you can show me 108. 119, show me 1097, code three to that roadblock request. I love the roadblock callouts. Oh yeah, that's so fun. It's just a shame that the civilians sometimes get a little wrapped up in them, but uh... Yeah, it is. <laughs> we got some, uh... Intoxicated drivers out on the streets tonight. Oh, we do. We definitely do. I'm really, uh, really happy with this uh, highway expansion. I know it's been out for a while now, but man, they really nailed uh, nailed it with this one. 119, show me 20 surround scene. Hey, slow your roll here. Let my partner get the spike strip set up. <laughs> uh, there we are. Oh my gosh, civilian just <laughs> went right over them. I yeah. thought that was the, the person we were maybe after. It's like he nope. almost got hit. Nope, right, they're gonna all stop there, perfect. 119, be advised, roadblock is in place. Okay, it's gonna be a red smart car, it's gonna be the vehicle we're after. All right, looks like oh, they're on. Oh, yep, yeah, they're gonna. Oh my gosh! <laughs> no, 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 no. Hey, ma'am, get out of the vehicle. Out of the vehicle now, ma'am. Get out the vehicle. With your hands in the air. One nineteen suspect is complying. On the floor, belly down. One nineteen suspect is complying. Do you want to go in for cuffs? I got you covered. All right. If you want to go hands on. All right. Okay, ma'am. I'm uh, just going to be placing you under arrest now, okay, for fleeing from law enforcement. So I'm just going to put, you, put some cuffs on you. 119 suspect in custody. Okay, ma'am. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance for the vehicle. Thank you, man. Appreciate that. Okay, Emily Cond, that is going to be valid, and that is also going to be valid for Alpha Golf 819. Okay, ma'am. At this time, you're going to be getting an additional charge for having an open warrant on your name, okay? And have you got anything on you that's going to poke me, hurt me, stick me otherwise? Vehicle search has been done, one handgun recovered. Okay, thank you. Okay, ma'am, you're going to be getting an additional charge for possession of a firearm without a permit. And anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one be appointed to you by the state of Franklin. No, it should cost you. Do you understand these rights? And do you have any questions for me, ma'am? Excellent. 119. Can I get a 32 down to my current 20 for a 1015? 10 for dispatch. Trooper, thank you for coming out. That suspect is going to be all yours. One 
119, can I get a 1051 down to my current 20 for an impounded vehicle? Down for dispatch. And 119, that fleeing driver call is going to be code 4, and you can show me 10 8. 119, show me 1097, code 3 to that major crime scene. That's good, we got a nice little cut across the highway fairly quick. Oh yeah, definitely. I, I had one of these the other night where it's like, I had to drive a couple kilometers up the road to turn around. I'm like, please don't, you know, have the have the call out expire before I get there. Right. It was a long haul. Yeah, sometimes you're racing against the um, timer on the call out there. Yeah. All worked out good. Oh, and look at this, it's on the other side of the road. Oh, are you <laughs> serious? Tried, it twice. <laughs> oh, we'll be fine. It's another turnaround oh, yeah. point. Yeah, we yeah, we got lots of time. Is that like the police precinct? Yep, it was one of them. Okay, I thought the I thought the crime scene was actually at the police precinct. I'm like, that's pretty ballsy. Yeah, <laughs> right inside the cop shop. <laughs> right, they could have just handed themselves in. Yeah. One nineteen, show me twenty three on scene. Are you uh, grabbing securing poles? Uh, yep, I am. Right, we don't right, have I'll any have the evidence markers. Any injured people, so that is always a good thing. Alrighty, perfect. Good evening, sir. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on you at all? Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Okay, Hokuto Larson, that is going to be a valid. Okay, sir. Uh, thank you very much for that. You are going to be free to leave. And for your own safety, I'm going to have to leave the area as well, okay? You take care now. You have a good evening. Evening, ma'am. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am, thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on you at all? Excellent, ma'am. Thank you very much. Okay, Hyun Suk Van Leuven. That is going to be valid. And that is also going to be valid. Perfect, ma'am. You are going to be free to leave. 
And for your own safety, I'm going to ask you to leave the area as well, okay? Thank you, ma'am. You take care now. Evening, ma'am. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol, would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate that. Do you have any idea on you at all? Excellent. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, Pilar Bakke, that is going to be a valid. And that's all going to be clear and valid. Perfect, ma'am. You are free to leave. And for your own safety, I'm going to ask you to leave the area as well, okay? Yeah, thank you, ma'am. Appreciate it. You take care now. Evening, sir. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Okay, here is Muladar. That is going to be a valid. And that's going to be valid. Perfect, sir. You are free to leave. Evening, sir. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol, would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir, thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on you at all? Excellent, thank you, sir. Okay, Sharon Guzman, that is going to be valid. And that's been clear and valid, sir. You are free to leave. And for your own safety, I'm going to have to ask you to leave the area as well, okay? Yeah, thank you, sir. Appreciate that. You take care. Okay, we have more evidence here. This broken mirror glass. Yeah, I, you got it? I, I took pictures of all the evidence, uh, but this mask, for some reason, whenever there's a mask on a crime scene... It never actually clears for me when I have an evidence marker and take a picture of it. Uh, yeah, you need to place two. Cause the, you do, eh? Yeah, the mask and the bag are separate pieces of evidence. Gotcha. That's why it, it didn't work then. And for some reason, it's not letting me pull up my tab menu to access my, uh, yeah. my evidence markers. Yeah. So let me see uh, if just, I can... Yeah, I'll say pop them back in the trunk and I'll do it. Uh, return the markers. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Yeah, well, that's good to know that you need to put two down. I figured because the pieces were side no. by side that you could yeah. put down the one and it would register both. No, they're considered so the separate definitely cleared, pieces of but... evidence. Yeah, you need to put it like try them right there. I'll give that a whirl. There we are. Perfect. Well, there, well, there. That's good to know. Now we've got it. 119, be advised, <laughs> I have a ID on a vehicle. It's going to be a black van, license plate 5, X-ray Juliet, Foxtrot 9, 8, and the RO is going to be a Rangel Lynn, and I'm going to be out looking for them over. All right. Good thing we had the commander on scene to teach the rookie officer how to take pictures of evidence. <laughs> Good stuff. <laughs> we got a black man. Yep. I'll keep my eyes open. Yeah, it looks like they flipped a the U-turn. That's them going down the other side of the freeway. Oh yeah, there they go. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Just love how, you know, the uh, every once in a while you get a driver that still makes that really weird move right in front of you. Yeah, I gotta love it. Welcome to the state of Franklin. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> thing about uh, having the evening shift is, is traffic's a little bit lighter, so that's good. Oh yeah, definitely. Had we been out and about in the daytime, I'm sure we would have uh, run into a few a few issues Probably. with our glorious citizens. <laughs> oh yeah. Alright, how far ahead of us is this guy? 900 odd meters by the looks of it. It's absolutely booking yeah, it. Yeah. it. Sure is. When we get close here, I'll confirm the plate. Oh, it looks like we might have had an issue here. Oh! No, he's still up ahead of us. Okay, uh, on my screen, it showed him <laughs> stop dead in the middle lane, and you just there it is. completely drove through him. I was like, what's going on? <laughs> Seems legit. Oh my goodness, that was funny. him on the left-hand lane. Now just moves into the middle lane. Yeah, I think you're right. I'll try and read the plate. That might be the vehicle we're looking for. Okay, perfect. Oh, he's actually pulling over. I did not expect that. 119. Could be on a 10-11 on our vehicle right now. Uh, 119 standby, possible 1080. Look at him. Oh no, don't hit the car! Please, thank you. Alright, here we are. Okay, I'm going to cover from this side for you. Good evening, ma'am. Okay. Ma'am, can you step oh, out of the vehicle for me, please? Yeah. <laughs> right. Looks like we're going to have to get this thing dealt with first. Okay, sir, do you mind telling me what happened here? Okay, sir, I appreciate it. Any idea on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle? Okay, Fabrizio Hoffman, that's going to be valid, and that is also going to be valid, A2 to Victor Kilo 2-4. I've got the suspect code, I'm covering her. Okay. Sir, have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Uh, if you wanted to go ahead and deal with her, because it looks like we've just had an accident right behind our patrol vehicle there. Sure did. Yep. Alrighty. All right, sir. You are free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. 119. Can I get a 1051 down to my current 20 for an immobilized vehicle? Ten four dispatch. Right, I will go ahead and search for a van. We are confirmed. This is our driver. Yeah. Expired ID, expired insurance, and an open warrant. Wonderful. To start. <laughs> Plus the fleeing. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. Uh, let's see here. Expired ID. 
and insurance. Oh, whoa, 119, 1070. Ma'am, <laughs> stop running. Unbelievable. Ma'am, stop running. She this is extremely dangerous. <laughs> taser, taser, taser. 119, taser deployed. Suspect failure to comply. Unbelievable. Ma'am, please don't. <laughs> this is just going to end up getting even worse for you. Alright, ma'am. And it's time you're under arrest for fleeing from law enforcement. Please sit around and place your hands behind your back for me. Anything you say can or will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one bit point you, but instead of Franklin, I'm not to cost you. Do you understand these rights? Do you have any questions for me, ma'am? Excellent. 119, one in custody. Alright, ma'am. Just going to move you over here so you're not in the middle of the freeway. Okay, ma'am. Anything on you going to poke me home? You stick me otherwise. Okay, perfect. Ma'am, at this time you're going to be getting additional charges for an expired ID. Uh, for no valid insurance. And for having an open warrant out in your name, okay? One nineteen, can I get a thirty two down to my current twenty for a ten fifteen? Vehicle search complete. Okay, thank you. Right, that is that dealt with. Still with this accident, unbelievable. <laughs> Oh my goodness. There we are. Documented all the debris that's on the road. Perfect. I'm just going to set up some cones for safety here. All right. Good evening, sir. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance on a vehicle? Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Okay, Ryota Jenkins. That is going to be valid. Uh, be advised, excuse a possible DUI on this one. Roger. Okay, sir, at this time you're going to be getting a charge for no valid insurance. And have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs I should be made aware of, sir? Okay, 0 0.163, that is going to be DUI alcohol. Okay, sir, if that's best when a breath, you just provided you blew a 0 0.163 to legal limit instead of Franklin a 0 0.08. So for that reason, I'm going to be placing you under arrest for driving under the influence of alcohol. Please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me, okay? Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one bit point you, but instead of Franklin, it should cost you. Do you understand your rights? Do you have any questions for me, sir? Excellent. One nineteen one in custody. Alrighty, sir, anything on you is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me, or otherwise. One nineteen. Can I get a thirty-two down to my current twenty for a ten fifteen? Ten four dispatch. Vehicle search is complete. Okay. Just a couple of switchblades in there. Looks like we've got. Is it just the one vehicle involved? Yes, it does indeed look that way. Oh, it looks like the vehicle. This one's involved too. Okay. Mm-hmm. Could be another possible DUI. 
Looks like she's swaying back and forth a little bit there. Yeah, she's got a little wobble to her. <laughs> Evening, ma'am. Trooper Martin, Franklin High Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle? Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate that. Okay, Kira Mitharas. That is going to be expired. Okay, ma'am. At this time, you're going to be getting two citations. The first citation is going to be for an expired ID. That'll be between $75 and $100. And the second citation is going to be for no valid insurance, okay? Alrighty, ma'am. Have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Okay, 0 0.118, so that is going to be DUI alcohol. Do the vehicle search for you. Okay, thank you. Alrighty, ma'am, for that specimen of birth you just provided, <laughs> you blew a 0 0.118, the legal limit instead of Franklin is 0 0.08, so for that reason I'm going to be placing you under arrest for driving under the influence of alcohol, okay? Please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me. And anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, won't be a point to you, but instead of Franklin, I know it should cost you. Do you understand his rights? Do you have any questions for me now? Excellent. 119-1 one in custody. Alrighty, Nothing man. illegal in the car. Anything on you is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me otherwise. Okay, ma'am, you are going to be getting an additional charge for possession of a firearm without a permit. 119. Can I get a 32 down to my current 20 for a 1015? 10 for dispatch. One nineteen. Can I get a 1051 down to my current 20 for an impounded vehicle? Turn four dispatch. One nineteen accident scene is uh, going to be code four, and you can show me ten eight. One nineteen show me ten ninety seven code one stop road debris. Looks like that's directly behind us. It is. Yep. Yep. There it is. Yeah. we got quite a bit of stuff piled up on the road here. Yeah, we do. It looks like a dump truck may have shed some of its load. Team be advised that road debris is going to be removed, all lanes are going to be reopened, and uh, you can show me 10 8. I think that's the first time I've actually seen um, when you pass those construction scenes. This crane has got some, uh, some cargo there. It's lifting up onto the overpass. 119, Chevy 1097, code 3, stop major accident.
a look at this uh, convoluted mess. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Minimap doesn't quite know where the first accident is. <laughs> yeah, luckily we do. Mm hmm. Man, I know I said it earlier, but there's so many intoxicated drivers on the highway. It's just right. crazy. We're starting to get the mileage in today on the CVPI, that's for sure. Yeah, they are definitely uh, exploring a lot of the highways today. I think we might have to go up and off ramp the wrong way to get to where we're going eventually here. No, Jeez. it looks like it's taking us down here to do another U-turn. Yeah, that's oh, yeah, we're going to get that. That is an yeah, awkward yeah, yeah. accident to get to. This junction right here, uh, as some people have referred to as spaghetti interchange, <laughs> yep. it looks a lot like one of the ones going into my city. It's such a convoluted interchange. Less time than I thought it was going to take. That was in such an odd spot. Yeah, it was. 119, Jeremy 23 on scene. All right. Oh, we got a fire. We do. 119, be advised, we have a vehicle fire. I'm going to attempt to extinguish now. I'll block off traffic while we deal with this. Team be advised that vehicle fire is going to be extinguished. Good evening, ma'am. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Uh, would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on your sole license, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle? Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate that. Okay, Robin Webb, that is going to be valid. And that is also going to be valid. Zero Hotel Uniform Delta 71. Okay, perfect, ma'am. If you consumed any alcohol, take on any drugs that I should be made aware of. Okay, 0 0.009. I would have arrest her for DUI alcohol because she's driving a commercial vehicle, but that truck is in a real bad spot, so it's going to be her lucky day, I think, on that one. Ma'am, spare with me. I'll be back with you in a moment. Evening, ma'am. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle. Excellent, thank you ma'am, appreciate that. Okay, Heather Montgomery, that is not a driver's license and it is also expired. And she does not have any insurance. Okay ma'am, at this time you're going to be getting a citation for an expired ID for no valid insurance. 
Okay. Have you consumed any alcohol taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Okay, 0 0.156, that's going to be DUI alcohol. And DUI cannabis. Alrighty, ma'am. For that specimen of refuge just provided, you blew a 0 0.156, the legal limit instead of Franklin is 0 0.08, and you also tested positive for cannabis, so you're going to be placed under arrest for those, and you're going to be further arrested for driving without a driver's license, okay? So if you please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me, anything you say you can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one be appointed to you at a state of frank. I know it should cost you. Do you understand his rights? Do you have any questions for me, ma'am? Excellent. 119, one in custody. All we righty, ma'am. two additional charges for her. She uh, has possession of excessive cannabis and a handgun yeah. in the vehicle. Okay, thank you. Ma'am, anything on you is going to poke me, hurt me, stick me otherwise. Okay, ma'am, at this time you're going to be getting two additional charges for possession of a firearm without a permit and for possession of excessive cannabis. Okay, so you're going to be further arrested for those. Alrighty, ma'am. If you're in safety, I'm going to place you in the back of my vehicle. Come with me, please. And uh, mind your head for me. Good evening, ma'am. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle. Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate that. Okay, Mitter Svensson. That's going to be valid, and that is also going to be valid. 7 Echo India Papa 88. Okay, ma'am. Have you consumed any alcohol or taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Alrighty, ma'am. Just bear with me and I'll be back with you in a moment, okay? Good evening, sir. Trooper Martin Franklin High Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, sir, thank you very much for that. Do you have any idea on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance of the vehicle. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Okay, Shang Wu Suzuki, that is going to be valid. And he does not have any valid insurance. Okay, sir, at this time I'm going to be giving you a citation for no valid insurance. And have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of, sir? Alrighty, sir, just bear with me and I'll be back with you in a moment, okay? I say all the uh, photos should be complete. Yeah, you just missed one on the back of this white four door here. That's a bit on the back. Yeah, bumper. I saw that. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, sir. <laughs> Thank you for your patience and cooperation. Here's an accident report for you. And you are free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. You take care. Alrighty, ma'am. Thank you for your patience and cooperation. Here is a accident report for you. And you are also going to be free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. You take care. One nineteen. Can I get a ten fifty one down to my current twenty for an immobilized vehicle? Ten four dispatch. Are we uh, 
setting this commercial driver free? Uh, yeah, she will be uh, free to go. What 19? Can I get a 1051 down to my current 20 for an impounded vehicle? 10 for dispatch. I think our patrol car might be in the way of him. There we are. Perfect. One nineteen, a highway accident is gonna be code four, and you can show me one ten fifteen, ten nineteen. Man, I just looked up at our shift clock. Time flies when you're having fun. Almost oh, definitely, <laughs> yeah. Definitely does. It's uh, down to the last few minutes here. Oh, yeah. Doesn't even feel like we started more than five minutes ago. Right. <laughs> what I really love about the, the highway action, there's just so much to do. You're just constantly... Busy. Like, there you go. Uh, just had a four-car pile yeah, up in front of us. 119, <laughs> show me on the scene of an accident. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Well, All like, the drivers um, in this yeah. city. Well, that just escalated fast. And he's running down the road. He's fleeing. What is going on? 119, show me in a 1070. Hey, sir, stop running. Why is he running? He's got to have something on him. Oh, no. Sir, stop running. FHP. Taser, taser, taser. 119 taser deployed, suspect failure to comply. Alrighty, sir. Right, um, do you not want to talk to me? Maybe you'll talk to my partner? No? We'll, we'll, we'll see. Nope. Alright. Unable to talk. Alrighty. Well... Yeah, we'll just leave you there, and how about that? We'll deal with everything else. Right, we'll just say he's been arrested and carted off to the precinct. Evening, ma'am. Trooper Martin Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Alrighty, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance at a vehicle. Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate that. Okay, Su Young Katada, that is going to be valid, and that's also going to be valid. 5 Echo Juliet Mike 6 1. Okay, ma'am, have you consumed any alcohol or taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Alrighty, ma'am, just bear with me and I'll be back with you in a moment, okay? I think that scene that you're on is a single car accident and is not involved in this one. Hmm. I think. Evening, ma'am. Trooper Martin, Franklin Highway Patrol. Would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Alrighty, ma'am. Thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance, the vehicle. Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate it. Alrighty, Maria Joy, that is going to be expired and that is going to be valid 8 Foxtrot Quebec 002.
Okay, ma'am. At this time, you're going to be getting a citation for that expired ID. That'll be between $75 and $150. And have you consumed any alcohol or taken any drugs that I ship me to wear off? Okay, 0 0.111. That is going to be DUI alcohol. And EUI amphetamines. Alrighty, man, for that specimen of breath you just provided, you blew 0 0.111, the legal limit, instead of Franklin 0 0.08, and you also tested positive for amphetamines. So, for those reasons, you're going to be placed under arrest, okay? Please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me, and anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one bit point to you, but instead of Franklin, I should cost you. Do you understand these rights? Do you have any questions for me, ma'am? Excellent, 191 in custody. Alrighty, ma'am. Anything on you that's going to poke me, hurt me, stick me otherwise. Okay, ma'am, for your own safety, I'm now going to take you and place you in the back of my car. Come on me, please. Crime scene photographs have been, or accident scene, sorry, photographs have been completed. Oh, thank you very much. Alrighty, ma'am, mind your head. Oh, no, it oh, appears that this is car way up there. all the same accident. Yeah, I thought that was a single car. I forgot about that one, so That's I guess right. I'm not complete. <laughs> ah, it's all good. Now we are. Alrighty, ma'am. Thank you for your patience and cooperation. Here is an accident report for you, and you are going to be free to leave. You have a wonderful evening. You take care and drive safe. This was the car with the, the DUI? Ah, uh, that is correct. All right. I wasn't sure if uh, cause that guy ran. I wasn't sure which vehicle he came from. Looks like you came from this SUV over here. Yeah. Oh, we got a switchblade in the rear passenger side door. One nineteen. Can I get a ten fifty one down to my current twenty for an impounded vehicle? Temple dispatch. Alrighty, ma'am. Uh, would you mind telling me what happened here, what you saw? Okay, ma'am, thank you very much for that. Do you have any ID on you at all? License, registration, proof of insurance for the vehicle? Thank you, ma'am, appreciate that. Okay, Quang Ming Ryan, either you have a Tan in this photo, or this is not you. I'm gonna take a guess and say <laughs> that's not you. Okay, ma'am. Have you consumed any alcohol, taken any drugs that I should be made aware of? Okay, ma'am. At this time, you're going to be placed under arrest for possession of a stolen ID. 
please turn around and place your hands behind your back for me and anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law you have the right to an attorney if you cannot afford an attorney one will point you but instead of franklin no, it's cost you do you understand his rights do you have any questions for me ma'am excellent 119 one in custody Alrighty, ma'am anything on you that's gonna poke me hurt me stick me or otherwise Okay, perfect. Ma'am, here's an accident report for you. You're most welcome. Uh, would you mind walking her to the precincts once you've got yourself out of that predicament? <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to have to unstick myself here. Yeah, okay. Appreciate it. Yeah, because uh, the patrol car's already full, so... 119. Hi, good day. 10.51, down to my current 20 for an impound vehicle. 10 for dispatch, 119. Could I get another 10.51 down to the same 20 for an impound vehicle? 10 for dispatch, 119. Accident scene is going to be code 4. And you can show me two 10.15, 10 10.19. Okay, ma'am, mind your head for me, please. I'm stepping in for me and I'll take those cuffs off, okay? Alrighty, ma'am, mind your head for me, please. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, very interesting. Uh, the person I was escorting has just disappeared, but I'm still kind of walking with him in tow here. I'm holding on to something that's not there. <laughs> okay, ma'am. Step in here for me and I'll take those cuffs off, okay? Hopefully it'll uh, still show her when we get to the cells here. I appear to have somebody with me on your screen? Uh, negative. If you just go ahead and uh, do the good old reset trick and then, uh, yeah, we'll call it all good because uh, she's obviously decided that she didn't want to be walked to the cell. She just decided to uh, teleport herself. So, <laughs> that works for me. Okay, dispatch. Oh. Copy. We're outside. So no need to scream at <laughs> yeah, us. It, it teleported me back out onto the highway here. And I can't run, I can only walk. So you may as well end the shift and start the countdown. Alrighty. Well, I do thank you for coming out and joining me today, Giza. Uh, it's a pleasure to have you. As always, it's uh, it's great to be uh, 
included in your episodes. It's uh, it's a good time patrolling with the best commander in Police Simulator. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Well, that is going to do it for this episode. Uh, if you did enjoy that episode, then please don't forget to leave a like. And if you are new around here and you want to see more content just like that, then please do consider subscribing. But that is going to be it for me for this very special episode of Police Simulator Patrol Officers. And until the next episode, take care.